Resiniacs. You know the name. You've seen their trucks. Repairs, gas, and car wash. And now, add Resiniacs touch-free truck wash. That's right, ladder truck, box truck, and lifted truck. Located across the street from the Apple Tree Business Park on Union Road. Stop by today to register your truck to receive 24-7 wash access and get your truck clean at Resiniacs. Good morning, everyone, and thanks for tuning in to Hammer Time TV, brought to you as always by Lakeshore Savings Bank. I'm Dominic Cortez. Now, you're probably used to seeing our show on Sunday morning at 10.30, but soccer takes precedence tomorrow. So a special welcome to those who may be seeing us for the first time and to all the moms watching. Happy Mother's Day. Well, we've got a fantastic show for you today. I'm with decorative painter Tim Martin. He's best known for creating custom finishes, and you're going to want to stay with us for that. Then, from locks to switches to speakers and everything in between, there are a ton of ways to get your home connected these days. That's right, and it seems that almost every day something new comes out on the market. I'm obsessed with anything that makes my life easier or more entertaining, so today I'll show you some of my favorite ways to smarten up your home without breaking the bank. Then, our friends from Big L Windows and Doors are with us. It's May. Time to bring the outdoors in with some very cool doors. Our friends from Real Help Concrete have some tips on maintaining your decorative concrete. But right now, let's get things going with your questions in our viewer mail segment. Viewer mail is brought to you by MP Carroll Hardwood, your wood floor pros since 1985. Well, it's that time of the show, my favorite time, where I get a chance to solve your home improvement and maintenance dilemmas. Oh, by the way, if you have a problem around your house, I can help. Just simply contact us by emailing us and we'll solve it right here. And our first question happens to be a video question. Hi, Dominic. We just moved into an older home where almost every room is wallpapered. We're not sure if we want to paper over it or paint over it or if we should just remove it. What would be the best way of removing it? Any advice you have to offer would be greatly appreciated. Thanks. Well, I can imagine what you're dealing with. And uh, the hope here is that the wallpaper was properly installed. If it was, that means they sized the walls before they applied the wallpaper, which usually will mean that it'll come off with a pull. So do a test and see and hope and pray that it was done properly. If not, well, then we've got a real challenge on our hands. You may have to rent steaming equipment to remove that wallpaper. You may have to employ some chemical process to get it off. And uh, I would suggest you remove it. I do not think you should paint over it, nor do I think you should apply wallpaper over wallpaper. You're just compounding the problem. So let's hope it was properly sized and we'll go from there. Well, once again, our show producer, Ben Fantaski, is out and about. What you got for me, Ben? Dominic, I'm here with Peter, and he, like myself, has a few little ones at the house. Pete, what's your question for him? Well, here's the problem. My wife and I have our bedroom on the second floor. We're both up really early in the morning getting ready for work. We have to be really careful about where we step because certain areas of the hallway creak when you walk there. Now, we have a couple of little ones, and the last thing we need is to have them up at 6 in the morning when we're trying to get ready. Hallway is completely carpeted, but we have to get to those squeaky floorboards underneath. Is this a quick fix? Actually, maybe the squeaks are going to be an advantage for when those kids become teenagers and you're wondering when they're getting back home in the house, right? Yes, there is a solution. Uh, and there are screws available that you can buy at home centers that are designed for this application. You can actually go right through the carpet and screw that uh, joist tight to the subfloor. That'll tighten up that squeak, eliminate it, and leave the carpet right in place. Well, our final question today is a Facebook question, and it comes from Joe. Joe writes, hi, Dominic. I'm hearing more and more about homes being equipped with smart devices. It really interests me, but I wouldn't know the first thing about installing these devices. Is there a place you can recommend that handles that service soup to nuts? Well, smart devices have become part of our life, have they not? At our place, it's the Alexa. 
We use it for our grocery list and for listening to music, but for all the other stuff, you should see what Nick's got going on at his house. It wasn't too long ago that the only way you could turn on a light without touching a light switch was that clapper. Remember that? Now if you have a smartphone or you have a smart watch, you can pretty much control any device in your home. I'll give you some tips today on how to do that on a budget. The first step to making your home smart is picking out a hub that you like. You could go with an Amazon Echo, Amazon Echo Dot, Google Home, or Apple's new product, the HomePod. All of which range in price from $50 up over $200. The hub is your virtual assistant that takes all of the commands that you give it and executes them to the smart devices in your home. Once you have your hub in place, you can control things like the lights. Alexa, lights. A robot vacuum. Missed the spot. Smart remotes for your TV, such as the Harmony remote. Alexa, TV. Smart thermostats like the Nest. Ugh. Alexa, turn up the temperature. That's better. It's okay if you have a smart device that doesn't communicate with your hub or one of the other smart devices, because there's a free app called IFT, which stands for If This Then That. What it does is it creates a recipe that allows one smart device to talk to another smart device that may not be able to do that on their own. An example of when I used IFT in my home was when I purchased the Wemo Maker, which is a relay switch. I used it for my garage door, and it didn't communicate with my Amazon device. Alexa, trigger garage door. Using a hub to automate your smart home, I rate that one out of five hammers on the hammer time scale. If you'd like to get more in depth and learn how to switch out your regular switches for smart ones, go to hammertimetv.com and check out my brother Phil's video. The wood floor leader for Buffalo business, MP Carroll. Top quality hardwood, expert installation, and customer service that will knock you out. MP Carroll, the trusted hardwood pros for Buffalo business. Quality work is what makes Salino Plumbing and HVAC your number one choice, but it's also about our same day service. Fully stocked trucks, ready to go. Keeping you informed every step of the way. And it's about the booties and drop cloths too. Knowledgeable, friendly, and neat make Salino Western New York's plumbing and HVAC experts. Call 6 H plus Salino. 6 H plus. Back in 1964, my mom and dad started Twin City Glass in North Tonawanda. We offer shower doors and mirrors. We carry three different lines. We consider them to be the best available. Today's bathrooms are becoming so monumental. Everything's different. There's not one shower door fits all anymore. We pride ourselves on the custom end of our business, and we feel our products are also superior to what everyone else out there is using. If you're in the market for a new shower door, mirrors, upgrading your bathroom, call Twin City Glass, 716-694-3300, or visit our website at TwinCityGlass.com. Hi, Dominic Cortese here. For over 60 years, my family has helped build West New York with products and supplies from our friends at Scranton Thruway Builders. I want to invite you to experience that same quality and service that we've come to expect. So, what are you waiting for? Stop on down and let Scranton's help turn your dreams into reality. The wood floor leader for Buffalo business, MP Carroll. Top quality hardwood, expert installation, and customer service that will knock you out. MP Carroll, the trusted hardwood pros for Buffalo business. This portion of the program is brought to you by Lakeshore Savings Bank, putting people first. For over 42 years, Big L Windows and Doors has been providing West New York with the best window and door products available, and then matching it with unbeatable quality service. 
Big L is a Western New York staple, and it's a third generation family run business. Here to tell us more about it is Bill Horbett Jr. Billy, hi. Hey, how you doing? Thanks for having us out. Well, thanks for having me. Now, Big Al is Western New York's replacement window and door leader. You cater to contractors, builders, and everyday homeowners. Let's talk about some of the products and services that Big Al Windows and Doors provides its customers. Well, Dominic, one of our main goals is to provide Western New Yorkers with solutions to any window and door need from residential to light commercial. We start right from the design stage and we can go through installation and we service the product after it's installed as well. So we try to find solutions from a simple storm door all the way to a commercial building filled with Marvin windows. All right, Bill, let me put on my Dominic the homeowner hat for a minute. I know a new window and door is a good idea perhaps for my drafty home. Walk me through the process. What should I expect once I make the call of the Big L? Well, initially uh, we, we like to come out to your home to do an assessment because mm -hmm. we find that's the best way to find a solution. You call in, we make a appointment, convenient to your schedule, we do evenings, Saturdays. We take a look at the home, see what's going on there. Right. We don't want to give a solution that might not be best for you. Of course. After that, we can give you some information about the windows and doors. We carry a little bit about our company. Sometimes we can price the entire job right then. How long uh, should I expect an order to take to, for delivery? Usually it's six to eight weeks from that initial contract, excluding specialty items. You know, everyone here talks a lot about doing the right thing. Mm -hmm. I'm inclined to think it's more than just a slogan. What does doing the right thing mean to you, Bill? In a word, it means honesty. Every day, try to do our best job, um, but sometimes we make mistakes. And if we do make mistakes, we try to rectify them to the customer's satisfaction. So that's really it in a nutshell. We have that in our total trust guarantee. It takes the manufacturer's warranty and takes it a little bit further. You know, you are a dad and I go back, and you're the third generation of the company. I guess you can say the legacy continues, but you have to admit uh, things are different than they were in 1975, right? Yes. The economy the, and the landscape is changing. Everywhere you look here in Buffalo and West New York, you see things happening. How do you see Big L Windows and Doors fitting into all of that, and where do you see yourself in 10 years? Yeah, it certainly has changed. Uh, 1976, it was just storm windows and storm doors, and now the choices are almost endless. Um, it makes things a little more complicated, but we can find a solution for almost anyone, and anything now. So I see us just continuing to improve. That's our main goal. We want to grow like Buffalo is, but we feel if we improve what we do, we can improve the lives of the people that work here, the people of Buffalo, improve ourselves, we can improve the city. So with all of the activity that's going on in the Renaissance of Buffalo, I imagine you're playing a role in uh, the creative reuse, especially of a lot of the lofts downtown. Yes, we are. It hasn't stopped. It's really continuing to grow a lot. All these old buildings, we're seeing them uh, reused, and we've played a big part in that. Uh, we have a window from Marvin that makes a lot of historic uh, qualifications. Mm. So it's really been helpful for us to get involved. Well, Billy, I can see that the company is in great hands for the next generation. Thank you. Folks, keep in mind whatever your windows or door needs are, whether your house was built in the 1800s or was built in the 1960s, Big L is the place for you. 2727 William Street in Chictawaga. We'll be right back after this. Closed captioning is made possible by Ventura's Car Star Collision. Car Star, relax. We'll take it from here. After being involved in an accident, one of the first things you think about is getting your car repaired as quickly as possible. But where do you go and who do you trust? The only name to keep top of mind and stored in your phone is Ventura's Car Star Collision. When it comes to customer service, quality, warranties, and peace of mind, we've got you covered. Leave it to the pros at Ventura's Car Star Collision. Relax, we'll take it from here. I'm a third generation concrete contractor. Grandfather started the business 60 years ago. We have upwards of 100 years experience on our crew. We install stamped concrete, exposed aggregate concrete, and standard broom finished concrete, comprising of patios, driveways, garage pads, in-ground pool surrounds, walkways, porches, and steps. I've been big since day one on providing quality, efficient, and speedy service. If you're looking for concrete and you need help, call Real Help at 997-3058 or visit our website, realhelpconcrete.com. 
Ava Roofing and Siding is your local roofing and siding experts. For years, Ava has provided customers from all over Western New York with superior service and value. Their careful approach to each job guarantees they provide the service you need at the right price. I'm so glad that I chose Ava. I would highly recommend them to anybody looking for a roof. Just a professional job, courteous and kind to my neighbors. Visit them online or on Facebook to see examples of their work. Ava Roofing and Siding, because every dollar saved counts. Specializing in professional carpet and upholstery cleaning, Seifert Cleaning is the name customers trust. Whether it's steam or deep cleaning, stain removal, or even fire and water damage restoration, Seifert Cleaning has the solution to make your home look new. Call today and get three rooms cleaned for just $99, or one piece of furniture cleaned at regular price with half off the second. Seifert Cleaning Company, the clean you expect, the service you deserve. And we're back. We do want to welcome Seaford Cleaning as a new sponsor to the show. You know, other than the fact that we always want our carpets looking their very best, there's another reason to have that carpet cleaned. It eliminates bacteria, mites, and germs hidden deep in your carpets that can act as a breeding ground for these little guys. Regular carpet cleaning will take care of this problem. At the same time, it will prolong the life of your carpet. So give Seaford's a call and tell them Dominic sent you. Moving on, what most people like about their decorative concrete is that it's durable and easy to maintain. Still, there's a right way and a wrong way to go about maintaining it. If you need some help with that, the guys from Real Help will be there to help you. When making the initial investment of a stamped concrete patio, you want to ensure the longevity of the product, both structurally and aesthetically. Over the course of the first year, you'll start to see it dull down quite a bit. You could start to see some spots. It's the actual sealer lifting off the surface, taking some of the color with it. That's very common. When we come back and reseal it, it blends right back in. And we recommend a biannual maintenance plan to keep the color locked in, the surface protected from UV light, foot traffic, and spills. So if you do happen to spill anything on the concrete, or stain it in any manner, it is a lot easier to clean up when it's properly sealed and protected. When you see a buildup of sealer that you can actually pick off with your finger or discoloration, that's when you should call a professional. Initially, you want to thoroughly clean all the concrete areas that you're looking to seal. You can use a 2800 or higher PSI power washer, making sure you do not get too close to the surface. You can damage the concrete, even if it still has remnants of sealer on it, by getting too close to the power washer. Then you're gonna to want to clean it with some kind of degreasing agent, whether it be Simple Green, Dawn Dis Detergent, some kind of degreaser to get all the excess dirt off. Then rinse it thoroughly. Before applying a sealer, you have to ensure it's 100% dry before you seal. Think of solvent as an oil-based product, oil and water don't mix. Any moisture on the surface can cause a haze or a whiteness to the concrete. After it's 100% dry, you then seal it. Really any solvent-based acrylic sealer that's a 25% solid or less is what you want to use. My recommendation to a homeowner is not to use the super high sheen, high shine type sealers. They can be very slippery, they can be very hard to work with, and the application methods are very limited in what you can do. After detailing around all doors and windows, you're gonna to wanna to get a sprayer, and we recommend two light, light coats. After that drying time, I'd say is anywhere from 10 to 20 minutes, and it's sealed. When looking for that professional sealing service, call Real Help at 997-3058 or visit our website, realhelpconcrete.com. This portion of the program is brought to you by Gorilla Garage Gear, authorized installers of Gorilla Flooring and Gorilla Garage Doors. And by Tim Martin, muralist and decorative painter. Transform the ordinary to the extraordinary. There is no doubt that what muralist and decorative painter Tim Martin creates is art in its truest form. He's well-respected across America and internationally. 
Tim calls Buffalo home, and Buffalo and West New York are proud to claim him as one of our own. Tim, it's great to finally meet you. Put the name to the face and to thank you personally for our wonderful backdrop. Dominic, it's my pleasure. I'm glad to be here. Now, Tim, you have traveled all over the globe as a professional muralist and decorative painter. We'll get into those two worlds in a minute, but I've seen your work. It's truly breathtaking. When it comes to painting the murals, how would you describe your style? Well, I seem to mimic a lot of the traditional uh, masters, and it all depends on what my client wants. So if they want old world, I mm -hmm. will definitely bring old world. If they want modern, we'll definitely pull in That's the modern. Great. That's great. So let's talk about your clientele, both in terms of those interested in the work you do in creating murals, as well as Tim Martin, decorative painter. Well, most of my clients are from all walks of life. Uh -huh. But as, as the norm, most of the middle class folks are the ones that want to definitely do this. You'd think the, the high end stuff would be what a, a lot of the high end homes sure. would want. Sure. And on the average, I'm mostly in middle class homes and I'll bring anything to life that anybody has an idea, a dream, an inkling. And it's it just crazy ideas that people sure. come up with that I'll bring, just totally bring to life. And you can me. appeal to any pocketbook. Yes, yes. Well, let's say I'm not sure what is it that I really want, but I know that I want to change things up. Maybe to not only brighten up a ceiling or a wall, but maybe to make a statement. Now, I'm one of those people that is open to ideas, but how do I get started? How do I make this dream come together? Well, first, give me a call. I'll come in, we'll set up an appointment. I'll take a look around the, uh, your area that you need done, um, sort of like an interior designer. Okay. So, mm -hmm. say you might not have an idea, but you have all the other elements in your home that are ready to go, that are there. Say you've got a, a piece of furniture okay. that you want mm -hmm. to be the accent, then we can put a, a wall behind it to give that accent to make that piece of furniture stand out. It sounds like you're really creative. Yes. So you have another dream, don't you? And that's to pass along your skills and techniques to the next generation so that they too can leave their artistic mark on the world. Yes, um, I'm looking forward to this coming year to have a curriculum set up to teach the folks who want to learn these different techniques or to come into the field. It's my passion that this is something that has to be you know, passed on. Well, Tim, I gotta tell you, it's been a great honor getting to know you. Tour your gallery, experience firsthand some of the incredible work you do. Well, thank you, Dominic. It's been my pleasure, and, and thank you for having me on Hammer Time TV. If the time has come to beautify and transform a space in your home or business, Tim Martin, muralist and decorative painter, is the call you should make. He'll make your decorative dream come true. Customers choose Lakeshore Savings not only because we're a local bank, they choose us because they know they can depend on us. Being headquartered right here in western New York, ensures that you'll receive quick answers to all your questions from people living right in your community. Lakeshore Savings has a history of strong support to local businesses. We're proud of the firms we've helped to develop and grow in Western New York. Let our commercial lenders partner with you to build your future. Banking with your best interest in mind. It's how we do business. Water is essential to our everyday life and a water filtration system from Salino can make it cleaner and better tasting. When it comes to whole house water filtration systems, you have options. We provide free water testing to determine the best treatment solution that will give you fresh, crisp, and clean water. And you'll have peace of mind knowing that it's safe for your family. So call us today and let Selena Water Treatment provide a customized solution for you. Joe Basil Chevrolet Commercial Trucks is Western New York's only business elite General Motors dealer. Our dedicated commercial and fleet salespeople have over 75 years of combined experience specializing in commercial vehicle sales and financing. Our service department and quick lube facilities are certified in both light and medium duty trucks. Over 120 commercial vehicles available at Western New York's number one commercial vehicle dealer, Joe Basil Chevrolet Commercial Trucks. For all your duplication needs, call our courteous and professional staff. Key Video is ready to go to work 
for you. This portion of the program is brought to you by Key Video Productions, producing persuasive and compelling content to help grow your business. Moisture in the bathroom is a real problem. It can lead to mold, drywall damage, and just overall a bad situation. Today we're going to show you how to properly remove an old bath fan, install a new one without damaging the drywall. Come on, let's go check it out. Hey Jake, how's it going? It's going pretty good, Phil. I'm getting ready to replace this underpowered fan. Um, as you can see over there, there's a lot of moisture damage on the walls that are starting to mold towards the base of the shower. This bath fan we're about to replace is quite small for a bathroom of this size. On top of that, it's quite loud, isn't it, Jake? Yeah, listen to this. Before we go any further, did you make sure the power is turned off? Yeah, Chelsea's downstairs right now identifying the breaker. Hey Chelsea, how's it going? Did you find that breaker yet? Yep, found it right here. Homeowners, it's very important to take care of your safety first. Turn the breaker off to ensure you don't electrocute yourself upstairs. Once our power was off, Jake got started by removing the old fixture. Jake used his meter tester to ensure we got the right breaker. Now that we know the power's off, we can safely remove the old fixture, disconnect the wires in preparation for the new fixture. We're all set down here with the removal process. The rest of it needs to be done up in the attic. Chelsea's up in the attic removing the ductwork and the housing from the framing. Be very cautious on where you step in the attic. You don't want to fall through the new drywall. Meanwhile, Jake's downstairs in the bathroom prepping the new fan for the installation in the ceiling. Now that we've removed everything correctly, we can go ahead and start the installation process, right Jake? Yep. We start by taking quick dimensions of the new fan. We trace those dimensions out on the ceiling and carefully cut the old drywall down. You can use a drywall saw to cut this opening. Ensure that you've checked behind the drywall that there's no hidden pipes or wires in the way. Jake's prepping the new fan for wiring. Remove the knockout from the fan. Wires can be fished through the new fixture. Always consult your owner's manual for the correct wiring in each home. Once the hole is prepped to accept the new fan, rewire the unit, connect the ductwork, and get ready to turn that breaker back on. Finally, we add the two light bulbs in the fixture and install the trim piece. Okay, let's give it a twirl to see if it's working properly. There's a light, fan's on. It's moving the air we need it to move, and it's a lot more quiet. On the hammer time scale, we're gonna rate this one three out of five hammers for time and difficulty. That wraps up this job. We're on to the next one. Well, that's all the time we have for this edition of Hammer Time TV. Next week, we're back at our regular scheduled time, Sunday morning at 1030, and we hope you'll join us then. Don't forget our Hammer Time radio program on WBN Saturdays at 10 o'clock. So, from our set here at Scranton Surrey Builders, a division of United Materials, the key video production television crew, and all of us at Hammer Time TV, we'll see you next Sunday. Enjoy your day tomorrow, moms. Happy Mother's Day. Quality work is what makes Salino Plumbing and HVAC your number one choice, but it's also about fast professional service. High efficiency equipment. Upfront pricing and 0% financing. And it's about the booties. And drop cloths too. Knowledgeable, friendly, and neat make Salino Western New York's plumbing and HVAC experts. Call 6-H-Plus Salino. 6 -H